On this Veterans Day, we meet one woman who has used the grief of losing her husband in combat to help others honor the service of and sacrifice of the American military. Donnie Backus has her story. He was the person who saw me in ways nobody else did, and I think that's that's the power of love. When Lisa Hallett's husband, Captain John Hallett, was killed by an IED in Afghanistan in 2009, she leaned on the thing that kept her going during her years as a military spouse. Running was always a way for me to parallel the challenges John's faced in military service with a challenge of my own. At the time of his death, Lisa and John had three children under the age of three. Their youngest never met John. She was just weeks old. I could go and run and feel all of the big feelings that I needed to and then come home and be that mom that my children needed and deserved for me to be. Running in community supported Lisa as she navigated and worked through her grief and loss. To help others, Lisa and a fellow Army wife started Wear Blue Run to Remember in 2010. Nearly 15 years later, through community runs and mentorship, the organization has helped thousands across the country heal from the devastating loss of a military loved one. It really is about bringing like-minded individuals so that they can connect over their shared experiences, their shared losses. This year, to remember John and raise money for families of fallen soldiers, Lisa ran the 150K long Wonderland Trail around Mount Rainier. Hallett, who lives in Washington State, says it was a natural choice to honor John. Here's this beautiful precipice in our backyard um, that really encompasses all the things I wanted John to know. Beauty, hard work, achievement. She says doing hard things has allowed her to confront her grief and take the steps to move forward. Now she and others run for the fallen, the fighting, and their families. Donya Backus, CBS News, Los Angeles.